going down, I'm gonna to talk to you today about post-workout nutrition. There is a lot of confusion around if you should consume carbohydrates after you work out, even when you're trying to lose body fat. Okay, so let's, let's break it down. When we exercise, I'm sure you've heard of this, when we exercise around, the, towards the end of the workout, which is somewhere between you know 45 to an hour, is when we start to release cortisol, okay? The stress hormone, why? Because we've been exercising, we're stressing the body out, and therefore cortisol starts to rise. So you've probably heard of it as, again, the stress hormone, which is designed to, you know, break down muscles, store body fat, all this sort of bad thing that we don't want. We want the opposite. We want to keep body fat, we don't keep body fat. We want to keep muscle, lose body fat. So cortisol does everything that we don't want. Now, how do we stop cortisol? Believe it or not, the easiest way and the best way to stop cortisol is to actually spike insulin. So insulin and cortisol work together in terms of when one's on, the other one's off, and when the other one's on, the other one is off. So when we can get insulin to spike, we turn off cortisol, okay? How do we get insulin to spike? Carbohydrates, okay? So in terms of if you still want to lose body fat, should you eat carbohydrates after you work out? The answer is yes. Now, obviously you're not going to eat as much as if you were solely trying to build muscle like a bodybuilder. You wouldn't be eating as much as him or her. But yes, you would still be wanting to eat a carbohydrate post-workout. So again, best post-workout nutrition would be obviously some sort of protein to help start the protein synthesis, but something along the sides of a carbohydrate as well. White rice, sweet potato, they're usually the best forms and the fastest forms of carbohydrates to get into your system. You actually want something nice and quick to really spike that insulin straight away and really stop that cortisol from elevating. So I hope this, uh, again, don't, even if you don't understand the whole cortisol insulin thing, don't worry about it. All you need to know is that even if you are still trying to lose body fat, you still can and should consume some form of carbohydrate post-workout because it's going to help you recover faster and it's going to stop the uh, muscle wastage that can occur with a longer, long periods of exercise, if that makes sense. Hopefully it does. I hope that helps. Take care and comb your hair.